those of you new to our channel, we are Rhonda and Joe with RVing with the Maracas. After we left Big Lagoon State Park, we headed east to Blackwater River State Forest to the campground in the Cruel Recreation Area near Milton, Florida. The campground was nice and had large campsites. The roads were paved and there were limestone campsite pads. We were in Site 34. The cost was $16.49 per night and we had water and electric hookups. Enjoy the video tour of the campground as we share some of our thoughts about this trip. First, we learned that it's important to make reservations ahead of time if you want to be able to stay in the warmer parts of Florida in the winter months. One of the reasons we decided to visit the Panhandle is because we were having trouble finding more than two or three nights in state parks in Central and South Florida. It was really cold in February at this campground. It rained much of the time we were there and our water froze a few times. Also, we had no cell signal with Verizon. This meant no phone or internet for service for us. If you watched our last video, we mentioned that we had just bought our new truck in Pensacola. We were waiting on some parts for the truck and it had been a bit hard to communicate without phone or internet. We ended up driving to Pensacola every few days to check on things. Unfortunately, the lake was dry because the dam that provided water to the lake was damaged by Hurricane Sally in September of 2020 and was still under repair. On a positive note, the hosts were great and very accommodating. This would be a fun spot to visit in the summer and once the lake has water again. There was a lot to do, such as hiking, swimming, and camping. Even though it was very cold, we did get out and do some hiking. We walked around the campground loop most days. One walk was on a runway that looked like it was used for events because there were structures that looked like they could be used for stages or food stands. We got lucky and the rain let up the last day we were there. The boardwalk trail dried out and was no longer slippery, so we hiked along the river and the Sweetwater Trail that led us to the second campground in the area, Bear Lake. Lake, the campground. It has water. It has water in its lake. <laughs> Unlike our campground, there's no water in the lake. We celebrated Valentine's Day at Grover T's Barbecue Restaurant. The food was excellent, especially the blueberry cobbler with ice cream. Thanks for watching and be sure to like the video and subscribe if you're new to our channel. Feel free to leave us a comment and tell us what you think. We'll be happy to respond.